Well, a lot of our targets, we didn't even see them. We bombed on a map reference. Uh, thick jungle, we couldn't see a lot of it. But uh, one of our worst ones, we lost two crews that day, <coughs> was to Hansa Bay. I think we were given wrong information, American information. They were often wrong. And uh, there was this one heavy ack ack position there, we were told and <clears throat> three squadrons of Voltis were sent up against it. But when we got there, there wasn't one gun, there were three. And uh, I know when we, we used to fly at about anywhere between 10 and 14,000 feet, depending on weather. And uh, just before we got to the target, we'd go off to echelon right always. And then we'd dive right over the target it took around 23 to 24 seconds to go down to ground level and uh, we'd dive at three second intervals so you had four or five in front of you going down. And at Hansa Bay in particular I lost sight of the bloke in front of me so instead of going for the one gun I went for another one nearby. But uh, we, we were very accurate. We could. Uh, we, we used to drop our bombs at about 2,000 feet Ease the nose very slightly out. Oh, I forgot to say we had uh, dive brakes, a bit like a ladder on each, up and down on both wings. And they slowed us down considerably. And as soon as we eased out of the dive, we'd slap the dive brakes in and we'd go to almost 500 knots, almost just a kick in the back. And of course you'd keep going down to get as close to the trees as you could and get away.